hey, now that it's more widely available, I thought I'd revisit Old Granddad 114. This has always been kind of a sleeper hit whiskey. It's been in and out of the market, but now it's back. So if you see it, I think you should definitely give it a try. It's the Jim Beam High Rye recipe. So it's basically the same thing as Basil Hayden. It's gonna have that foxiness, that yeasty flavor and aroma typical of Jim Beam. But what I like about this one is that because of the higher rye content, I think it has more fruit on the nose, more fruit on the palate. It's that combination of a little bit more fruit, a little more oak, which is kind of pushed through by the proof. But again, even at 114, extremely balanced. So I'm trying to pick between like a Knob Creek and this, I probably default to this just because even though it doesn't have an age statement on it, it tastes as if it's a six, seven, eight, nine year old whiskey. And it just has, has the proof, it has more flavor. Rich, creamy easy to drink. There's that foxy yeast note. You get a little bit of orange peel as well. Would make a great cocktail, great old fashioned because of the proof, but sip neat, sip on the rocks. It's just a great whiskey.